That's why you should fill your tongue with the praises to our God. Acknowledge God in every step of your way. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. When things don't work, give God the praise. Remember, it is going to work. I know the circumstance is hard today, but it's going to work. So I give praise to you, Lord. Even when you are sick, when you are on that bed, sleeping there, you can't even wake up your head. In your heart, tell God, I thank you because of this situation. It's just going to be for a time. And it is a cloud that is passing over. I give you praise. I thank you even for this circumstance. When you don't have finances, don't always see like God hates you. Like the world hates you. See God. Acknowledge God. Give Him praise even when things are not good. Let Him capture your heart. Let the Lord capture your life. Let God capture your will. Let everything about you be saturated with praise. Hallelujah. I like the way David lived. He lived a life of praising God when things were working and when things were not working. Hallelujah. Even when he walked through the tunnel of death, he still praised God because he knew even at this circumstance, you are still with me. He said, even if I lay my bed in hell, one thing I know is that I will sleep at peace for I know that the Lord is watching over me. Praise the name of the Lord. Give praise to God at all times. Do not be seeing the devil every time. Some things in life are not even brought about by the devil. They are not. Most of the problems that we have actually, they have been dragged to our lives by our ignorance.